what's up learners it's wednesday i'm filming from a less interesting part of my house today because the better computer is down here and mine takes like two hours to edit everything because it keeps being like so this week's theme is activism i don't like the word activism i'm just going to come out and say that because i know it just means being active and supporting a cause but i feel like the word has too many negative connotations around it like if you say activism i think of like awful protests with like picket fence and violence, uh, picket fence, picket signs and violence and everything and like the Occupy Brisbane protesters that we had and they were complete assholes and they didn't even really have a cause to fight for but they called themselves activists and there was this whole like they inconvenienced everyone just because they were fighting for human rights but none of them could come up with a clear definition of what it was that they were fighting for. And, like, I'm all for protests and stuff, that's awesome, do, do what you need to, but organise it, and have something that you're fighting for, don't just be like, yeah, we're fighting for human rights now. Obviously, I agree with all the gay marriage stuff, like, I just, I don't want to really talk about it, because I'll get all ranty, and I, it just pisses me off that, like, because you're, because you like someone of the same sex you can't have the same rights as everyone else like and i don't know it's it's like you're born that way i don't understand like, aboriginals get extra rights and stuff like they get a free ride into uni basically don't stop me on that there was this girl no i'm not gonna start on that um <laughs> but because they were born into a different culture but gay people can't get married because they're interested in the same sex and I don't understand how it's redefining the word husband and wife because if I get married, I will be someone's wife. If someone gets married to me, they will be my husband. They will be someone's husband. If Chris Colter gets married, he will be someone's husband. You don't even have to bring Guy and Girl into it. But anyway, also I probably shouldn't talk about the pony thing either because it really pissed me off. I had a friend who bought that $60 pack thing. And I'm like, oh yeah, so um, what's in the pack to make it worth $60? She's like, Rachel, it's not about the pack, it's about supporting the cause. And I'm like, oh, so um, where's your money going? Oh, I don't know. What are they going to do with your money? Mm, yeah, I don't know. Um, sorry, what? If I was giving someone $60, I would want to know where the hell that went. And that was just like everyone involved in Coney, like they had no idea what was going on, but they just wanted to feel good about themselves or something. I don't understand. Um, yeah, as far as activism goes, I'm not very involved. I'm, I'm pretty chilled about causes and stuff, which is probably a bad thing, but um, like, I don't know, I just don't get involved that much. If we're talking about charities and stuff, you can always give your money to brain research organizations because I am I actually really care about brain diseases and everything yeah um I they're really bad and I'm not gonna talk about why because that's really sad but um yeah I guess brain in, the brain institute and I don't, I don't know if that's an inter institute but places that research into like murder neuron disease and stuff. Hey, Marin, I will see you tomorrow.